Mark Spencer here from AppleMotion.net and RippleTraining.com with a quick motion tip about changing the color of live fonts. Now, when you have regular text here created with the text tool right up here in Motion, such as this text layer right here, and you want to change the color of that text, you can do so right here in the heads up display. There's a little color swatch. If you right click on it, you can sample a color and change it to whatever color you want, quick and easy. You could also click on the color swatch with the left clicking and go through and use one of these different tools here to select a color. It doesn't matter. So I'm going to undo that. However, if you're using a live font, for example, I'll go to the library to live fonts, and here we have a series of live fonts. These work a little bit differently. So I'll just grab one here and drag it onto my text. And now my text is made out of a live font, and it already has a color because live fonts are actually little QuickTime movies and every single letter is a movie in the live font and that's why they animate on and do little things. Now here if you want to try to change a color if you right click and sample nothing's happening. So you might figure okay I can't change the color of a live font but you can. All you need to do is go to the inspector, go to the text tab, go to the style section and where it says face, there's another color tag there. If you left click there, you can go ahead and sample and notice that the, con the font does change color. So you can go in here and just drag around to choose a color or just like in the heads up display, if you click directly on the color swatch, you can bring up the color picker and use saved values or type in values, whatever you want. But you can choose any color you want for your font. So that's the whole trick, is to go into the inspector, and you can change your font color right there to be anything you want. That's a quick motion tip. My name is Mark Spencer, and thank you for watching.